Each year, the Delaware Standard Bread Breeders Fund honors top broodmares in the program. And since it's Mother's Day, well, we want to recognize them even a little more here on Post Time. First, let's meet MLT Feds, who was honored as the DSBF Trotting Broodmare of the Year in 2018. She's the mom of first state champ Superfly, as well as Spunky MLT, who raced in Delaware Sire Stakes this past season. The daughter of Muscles Yankee only raced for one year back in 2009 and made less than $3,700, but she found her calling in the sport in other ways. MLT Feds, whose nickname is Melly, is owned by Ron Whitehouse. Ron and his wife Rhonda own the breeding facility Safe Haven Farm. And I got a chance to talk with Rhonda about MLT Feds and what she means to them. Rhonda, you own a breeding facility and through kind of a long and winding road of a story, <laughs> you ended up with MLT Feds, AKA yeah. Melly. But you know, people have just fallen in love with her here. Very much. She has, when she was ultrasound the last time, she had six people sitting there looking at the ultrasound. Melly is taken care of to the day she dies because if I can't take care of her, there are people waiting. <laughs> what makes her so special? Why do people like her? She's just a sweetheart. She's easy to be around. She's easy to work with. When she spooks, it's because she wants to, not because it's just like, okay, today is the moment, and then she's right back to being Melly. She's just, she's a classic stand of bread. She's just so laid back and easy to work with. I loved how I was watching her out in the field and then when she was going to get caught, she was like, eh, I don't know about this, you know? But she just kind of does her own thing. She's so cool. And she doesn't get violent about it. She's just like, you're not gonna catch me now. <laughs> and the wonderful thing is she has a purpose here even if she doesn't get in full, right? No, that's, she's a hard breeder. That's why they got rid of her. So here she can be a tease mare, she can be ridden, and she's kind of a mascot. I love it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Now, let's meet Queen Kathy, who was voted the Delaware Standard Bread Breeders Fund Pacing Broodmare of the Year for 2017 and 2018. She's the mom of first state champion Slick Tony, her first foal, as well as top performer Son of a Lynx. Slick Tony was not only a standout in stakes competition, but overall, he's made almost 450 grand and counting since he began racing in 2017. Queen Kathy, a daughter of Cam Best, raced from 2003 to 2012 with 30 wins, making over $160,000. Now, she is going on to prove even bigger accomplishments in the breeding shed for owners George and Nola Leaguer. So tell me, what does she mean to you as a racehorse and as a broodmare? Well, I never had her as a racehorse, but Tony's the best colt I ever had. I've been fooling with him for 50 years, and he's the best. And you've had some good memories with him. And he's only four, right? He's only four, yeah. So a lot more to come. Yeah, well, you can't never tell. Don't never talk about what they're going to do. You've got to often talk about what they've done. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. All right. Now, I want to hear about what kind of mommy she is. Well, she's never had trouble foaling. She has plenty of milk for all her babies. She loves her babies, takes good care of them. And, and they're always born just as round as apples. <laughs> She doesn't have little frail looking foals. She has nice, well developed foals. They stand up good as soon as they're born. This baby that we just saw, now tell me about this baby. This is a full sister to Slick Tony. So she's a no spin zone out of Tony's mother, Queen Kathy. And, the, and she's a cam best. Well, I thank you for having me at your beautiful farm, and um, hopefully there'll be more awards for Queen Kathy. She's won it twice, and we'll yeah, see what happens. Surprise! We didn't even know they had the award. <laughs> <laughs> well, you do now, right? You might get a picture of Tony playing with his ball. He's a ball player too, you know. Oh, all right. <laughs> He'd be in the big leagues if he was if there was ball playing horses. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go check out Tony then. Thank you so much.
Congratulations again to the connections on all the success that MLT Feds and Queen Kathy have had during their careers as broodmares in our harness racing business. And thank you to those moms for the impact that you have made on the sport. Happy Mother's Day.